morning. Welcome to the day two. We're just outside the Mirage waiting for our Uber. We're heading over to Wicked Spoon to uh, see how bad the lineup is. But, Hopefully it's not bad. Yeah. We're just reminiscing. Right there's the garbage can that I had to run to on the 58 hour trip with Jody and Darren. Uh, After he was sleeping on the slot machine at Circa. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we had a great day one. I'm actually keeping track right now of tips, food expenditures, gambling, everything. We'll see if I can do it for the whole trip. So that way, this will be like my personal uh, financial diary. So I can see how much it costs, <laughs> but we'll see if we can do it. But gambling, we ended up even for the day. So that's not bad. Uh, we had a lot, you saw lots of bonuses, lots of action. Gambled for about eight hours and ended up even. So that's pretty good. So you saw Vegas is busy. We'll see how Saturday goes. And uh, yeah, we'll catch up to you at Wicked Spoon. And check out Heather's shirt. <laughs> Shout out to- Danny Ryan and Kevin. Yeah, Vegas introvert, Vegas Matrix, Vegas. Zaddy. Zaddy. <laughs> All right, see you soon. <laughs>to set up for the show and dad and I have come to play Kino. I haven't really been feeling the vlog for some reason so I'm hoping this is the beginning of some extra fun Heather vlogging. <laughs> anyway so we're at Kino at Harris and we're gonna play 10 games at two dollars a game for twenty dollars and we pick five numbers. We're gonna play the red game because it's live so here we are I'll spin it around. Oh, and there's the waitress. That's what we've been waiting for. Dad got his pineapple in Malibu with a splash of grenadine. Cheers. <laughs> and my Red Bull vodka. Nobody's surprised. Okay, so we just left playing Kino at Harris. Didn't go as planned, but that's okay. Uh, so we're about to head into the link and we're going to play a uh, roulette system that my dad has been talking about for days. So the system uh, I saw on uh, YouTube and I thought we should go out and give it a try. So uh, we'll let you know how we make out. <laughs> okay. Back to the link. we're both up a hundred from playing roulette. Done? It was the system and it worked. <laughs> um, played like uh, two to one odds on uh, first 12 or uh, a roll and then if we won we uh, take the winnings and went to the next roll or next 12 and then if that wins we took the 45 and put it on uh, the next one and it hit. We yep. did it three times, so it worked pretty good. So uh, it could still have been a loss, nice but it actually worked for us. So yeah, and Dad was uh, he was up to three hundred dollars at one point, yes. and then we both kept going. Then we cashed out. We're both up a hundred. Yeah. So yeah, it was fun. 
Kino wasn't good to us, but roulette was. So. By the way, this was uh, to sit down on your own chair uh, roulette. Yeah, we weren't at a live table with people. Five uh, dollar minimum. We like, can't do it at the tables because they're like 15 to 25. Right. Okay. Well, okay. off to the next thing. Good luck. Bye. Dad just won again on his roulette thing. <laughs> yeah. He won it's $360 system. on number 23. Up 550, oh. look. Oh, yeah. 650, 610. Starting with $100. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm not doing as well. <laughs> John cashing out 600, nice little profit of 400 for us. It's huge. Okay, in case anybody was wondering where to get a Red Bull and vodka, the answer is Mirage. They bring you the vodka in a glass and the can of Red Bull. And look at the vodka. I know there's ice in there too, but are you kidding me? I barely have room for the Red Bull. So, and I also heard, I can't remember who had Bailey's here. It may have been Vegas Baby, but they got an entire glass of Bailey's when they ordered it. So, if it was them. The drink service isn't as quick here as most places, but when you do get a drink, it's definitely worth it. I'm doing a little segment this trip. It's called Drinks with Dad. Uh, I'm doing this because my dad isn't a drinker. And the odd time in Vegas, he'll have a pina colada, a strawberry daiquiri, or a Miami Vice. The last time we came to Vegas with my dad, November 2021, we went to play bingo at Plaza. <laughs> and when you buy in, you get two free drinks. He didn't know what to get, so I told him to try Malibu and pineapple with a splash of grenadine, and he loved it. So this trip, what we're going to do is go into a place, order two of the same drink, and he can give his review on how he likes it. Mostly going to be vodka based, things you can't really taste the alcohol because I don't like it, that either. So here we go. <laughs> Okay, so we have the first drinks with dad and we are at the center bar at Mirage and we got sex on the beach. So let's see if dad likes it. Give it a try. Is he driving? What do you think well, dad? If I have sex on the beach, I'll go without it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not too bad. Out of 10, what would you say? Uh, seven? All right, that's not bad. I am used to it being a little bit more yellow, not pink, but yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Quench the thirst. Oh, we should have tears. Oh, tears. Okay, we're here with Mike. He watches the vlogs. He's a Cleveland Browns sports fan, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. But a really good guy. Nice to meet you, man. Nice good to meet conversation. You guys. Yeah, Thanks for, sure. for uh, finding us here in Mirage. Absolutely. And uh, hope you kill it on the slots before yeah, you go Yeah, me too. Yeah. Nice meeting you but guys. But thanks for watching. Really cool. All right. Take care. All right. We're having no luck at Mirage except Don's uh, roulette system. <laughs> so we're struggling on the slots a little bit. So decided let's get off the strip out of Mirage. And we're here at Ellis Island. So we haven't been it's here been since November. Yep. So last time we are here with Don. So we <laughs> We brought them back. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna hopefully maybe play some cards. They got some different games in here for slots, and we'll probably have some dinner too. Yeah, something to eat. Some cheap dinner. So, just to switch it up, we'll, we'll bring you along if we get a bonus. If we're if allowed we to film, film. yeah, we we'll film. see. If not, we'll give you a recap when we come out when we're up thousands. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <right. laughs> bye.
leaving Ellis Island after a nice dinner. Uh, $11.99 steak dinner. And I know, you know what, you can comment in the comments about uh, it's garbage, but it was good. You know, was it the best steak I've ever had? No, but it was still really good. Uh, I had a grilled cheese. Yeah, steak, <laughs> fries, salad, and green beans for $11.99. That was good. We played a bunch of machines. Uh, we got a lot of features, a lot of bonuses, but nothing big enough to make us cash out. So we just kept playing, trying different ones, and we ended up even. So not the end of the world. Yeah, so nothing big enough to cash out, but enough to keep us playing. So now we're walking. We're going to head to Cosmo area. Heather ended up with some free play after our play last night. Um, yeah, I checked this morning and he said that he didn't have any until September 30th. And then I got an email after we left to come back for 60? Yeah, 60 bucks. Boys. Yeah, we played a lot there last night. Like I said, we, we ended up breaking out even. Uh, seems to be our motto, break out even. Uh, be nice to actually hit a huge bonus rate away so we can play on their money and pocket some profit. So. And we're going to see Nicole she's working yeah the waitress yeah so, so that's you know good. we're gonna leave there <laughs> so lots of drinks tipsy. yeah yeah so it's gonna be fun uh if we actually get some decent bonuses we'll film them we couldn't film in ellis island on the ones we got uh we weren't sure if they were gonna be good anyway and you're not supposed to film there so we just didn't bother but anyway food was good nice dinner and we got the night ahead of us before uh I go to the convention tomorrow, so it sucks. Anyway, <laughs> see ya, Cosmo. It's a nice night in Vegas. Sun's down, going down, it's not that hot. There's a high roller all lit up. Looks good. Top golf. Looking good. Look at Saturday night traffic, 7 o'clock, can't move. All right, I'm back on this game again. What is this? Oh, nice. All right, can I get the best one like last time? Let's see. Boo. Oh, oh no. That's devastating. We about to pick another prize. Nope. They, they already know ahead of time that it's getting nothing. Boo. Let's see how much I could have gotten in the other ones. Dang it. Okay, one more time. Clean it up. I'm so. Oh my god, this machine is starting to piss me off, and I'm not getting any of the U spins either. Uh, finally! I'm down to my last 88 cents, and I have finally got the U spin. Please, please be good to me. Yes, one more. Yes, 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 yes. Didn't spin very fast. Yes. Yeah, major would be great. Come on, come on, major, major. One six, make it. Yeah. Nice. Thank 
Back to the barrage. No winning in Cosmo. You know, we're down 200 over the two days now, which is not bad at all, but no bon no real bonuses. Whatever bonuses that were decent, you saw on the vlog. So uh, I gotta get up for work in the morning. So we're gonna head back and kind of be at our home base. Good morning. Welcome to day three. It's just after seven. Um, I'm headed to the convention, so I'm going to place some NFL bets on my way out before I go. I might hit one machine, see if I can get one Eddie Cam session, but I don't have that much time. So uh, yesterday, as you see, the vlog just died at the end. It was, we gambled hard as far as the slots all, all day after I set up for the show and I came back. It was nonstop gambling, but... The drink service was hit or miss everywhere. So Cosmo got a little better, but it's tough to keep the gambling going, especially when you're not getting a lot of bonuses and the drinks aren't coming like you'd want them to. So anyway, uh, it, we ended up just calling it an early night. We still have six more nights, so lots of time. And I kind of wanted to wake up not hungover for the first day of the convention. So hopefully NFL goes good today. You're gonna to see a lot of uh, Heather and Dawn during the day. And then uh, I will be meeting up with them later on. It depends on how things go and what my schedule's like, but there's definitely gonna be some more drinking and gambling. And then we're gonna hit it really hard Wednesday night to Saturday. <laughs> okay. Let's go NFL today, baby. Well, hopefully this is a decent bonus and we'll get one Eddie Cam in here. Uh, I just sat down before I'm about to leave. I made my NFL bets for the day. I put 100 in, three bucks to press, uh, third spin, because I got one line in. So it's only one cent, so these are small numbers to start, but hey, early bonus, that's how I like it. Let's go. Come on. Alright, that's good. I just need a I need a major or the minor to drop in here. Get some actual decent numbers. There we go. One more. Next row has 12 bucks, so that's pretty good. Come on. Oh yes, let's get this morning started right. Here we go, come on. Get me all the way to the top. Let's go. Yes, still alive, still alive. Feels weird to be going to work in Vegas, but uh, let's be honest. It's, it's a pretty good thing if uh, work is bringing me here for a trip, so I'll take it. Come on, don't die. Oh. I might have to use this. It's, it's garbage, but it might be all I have today. Uh, 20. All right, 32 bucks. Puts me up. I'll do a few bigger backup spins and see if I can catch something. I'd like to hit a couple hundred before I leave. Okay, no bonus here, but I just have to say, so after I left our, the bonus you saw on Firelink, I decided to do something stupid and go up to 750, a uh, press on that, and I got nothing. So then I'm like, okay, I'll try one more game. I came over here to Dragon Link, and I tried the dollar denomination, $5 a press. I've never got more five 
uh, fireballs and two flags in my life, almost every spin. So sometimes you get nothing on a game and you just want to be teased. That was the worst. So betting higher and getting so close almost every spin with some big numbers dropping too. So frustrating. So I'm glad I'm actually going to the convention because I'd be on tilt right now. <laughs> like I just want to shove a couple hundred in this and chase it, but I know I would lose it. So um, I'm leaving. So down 200 to start the day. So hopefully uh, Heather and Don have some luck while I'm at work and then uh, we can start back even later on. Okay, catch up to you later. I'm just about to run downstairs and meet up with dad while Eddie's at his conference. So I just wanted to recap quickly what happened yesterday that you may not have seen. So we ended up running into Dave and Michelle from We Work to Visit Vegas and I was with dad and they were eating at Diablo's inside the Mirage as we were walking in. It was so amazing meeting them, meeting them and I felt so bad that Eddie wasn't with us to meet them too because I know he really wanted to meet them. Um, but then as we were midway, mid conversation, Eddie ended up showing up. So that was amazing. I ended up giving them one of our new uh, casino chips that I made. And then they had one from their 2019 summit that they gave to me too, which was so nice. Uh, so it was great meeting them. Such a good feeling because we've been watching them since the beginning. And it's just awesome meeting people um, that you've been watching for so long. And then shortly after that, we had a viewer, Mike, come and meet up with us. And I know that we did put that in the vlog, but it was just super nice for him to come and meet up with us and have a drink with us. And that was great. Uh, and it's funny, he walked all the way down to Mirage to meet us. And then we ended up seeing him later uh, at the Cosmo when TVP was doing his um, group poll because it's his weekend, his meetup weekend here too. So that was amazing. And then we tried meeting up with Nicole for drinks at the Cosmo. Uh, she was there, but since we weren't having a very good winning streak, we were just like, forget it. So maybe we'll see her tonight. So hopefully today's a little bit better. Hopefully the drink service is better because I need to get some drinks in me. <laughs> uh, and then, yeah, we'll see how the day goes. So come back for the next one. Good morning. Uh, Eddie is unfortunately at work. <laughs> So Dad and I have started the day. Dad started earlier at Mirage waiting for me, but he didn't do so well. No. <laughs> so we're headed over to get some lunch, and I know Danny hates this, but we're going to in and out <laughs> Okay, so we came to Margaritaville for our second drinks with Dad, and we got the Bahama Mama. So let's see how he likes it. All right, here we go. Cheers. Cheers. That's good. Nice. I like that. Yeah, it is really a little, good. A little strong, but it's good. Yeah. Nice flavor. And I really wanted to stick to vodka drinks because that's all I really like and since he doesn't really drink, but this has two different types of rum in it, or three different types, and yeah, it's really good. Good. Successful drink. Okay, I had to get another one. I got the watermelon cannonball and it has watermelon Red Bull in it. It is delicious. Okay, so the bartender just came over and gave Dad some leftover of one of the drinks that he was making, and it is so mm, good. Really, really good. It tastes like what was it again? Do you remember? It's like a strawberry guy. I think it's uh, carnival, something carnival. Yeah, I'll find the name of it and put it up. But holy shit, really? we should have got that one. <laughs> mm. 
that's good. <laughs> I think I know where we're gonna come back. <laughs> okay, Dad and I are at Planet Hollywood. We are in desperate need of drinks while well, I am. Me too.
that's pretty cool. We're now leaving the Palms and heading over to the Rio. We were here to get a dollar chip, have dinner, and play a little bit. Eddie made us come in this sketchy side door at the Gold Coast. Now we're in an elevator, hoping to end up at the casino. We're long, who knows? Yeah. <laughs> We may be a trap. We're trapped. We're coming to play bingo, right? No, we're not. <laughs> no bingo? No bingo. What time is it? 3 p.m.? No. So. Oh my goodness. Oh, Look at that. We made it. That works. We made it. We're on day three and we weren't able to find Huff and more Puff until we randomly came into Gold Coast. So let's hope for a bonus. <laughs> Okay, no real bonus, but she got the hats fairly quickly too. 21 bucks a day. Two fifty for us, five cent machine, let's go. Reach your gas. Yes. Nothing but gold. And the gold curve. Let's go. Oh no, this one's moved. Yeah. 
gas to get more gold. I forgot it's off the bar. Come on. One more game. Another one. Another one. Another one. a major in one of those. We went to the Palms, then we came to Gold Coast, and won money, and now over to the Rio. Now we're at the Rio, trying Dad's roulette stuff again. <laughs> Heather, tell us your thoughts on the Rio. <laughs> uh, I'm never coming back to the Rio. No Red Bull, no raspberry vodka, no Malibu. No Malibu. No nothing. I have no drink. Yeah. I barely had a drink all day. Yesterday, nothing. Like, yeah, the just, drink service has been spotty. It is so at best. bad. It is so bad. Like, I thought we were supposed to be in Vegas. Like, I don't know what lame city we came to, but it's not, not Vegas. <laughs> so I'm going downtown tomorrow. And if I'm not drunk tomorrow, I don't know. I agree with her on the uh, drink service, but the night's still been fun. We've actually been winning a bit, and then... In the Rio, we ended up breaking even uh, on the roulette. And the plan was to try to win or break even and have a bunch of drinks. Well, I got one drink and Heather got zero. So anyway, we're heading back to the- To go to... get no drinks again anywhere else because nowhere else gives us drinks uh, either. We'll see, we'll see. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, we're back at Harrah's. We're playing this quick hit machine. We put 80 in, down to 22, max got to 
night uh the drink service is just basically Garbage. non-existent again i gotta be back at the convention tomorrow so we still got lots of time here so there's no point in chasing the slot machines sober you know at midnight so we're calling it a night and we'll see you tomorrow for day four mm -hmm. heather heads downtown <laughs> it better be fun it will be <laughs> okay heather what do you want to say to end Day four. I love downtown. She loves downtown. Yeah. She had a great day. Great day. She obviously got way too smashed. I love downtown El Cortez. There you go. <laughs>